In this tutorial, we will set the control outputs on the N-Series batch controllers. All N-Series have two relay outputs and at least one transistor output. As the main function of the N-Series is to control a batch, Relay 1 is always fixed as a non-configurable batch output. The other outputs can be set as Batch Output, which is identical to Relay Output 1. Pre-close, which is used for two-stage control. Alarm Output, in case of a no-flow alarm. External Alarm, in case an external alarm is triggered through the status input. Pulse, for a scaled pulse output signal. Pump, sets a time delay to start a pump before batch control output relay 1 opens. Off, which disables the output signal. You can set any output function to each configurable relay and transistor output. In this example, we will use a preset of 2000 gallons and configure one relay output as a two-stage control output with a pre-close of 100 gallons followed by configuring one transistor output as a pump control output with a pre-open delay time of 5 seconds. Let's take a look at how this works. Hold the program button for 7 seconds. Menu 1 preset appears. You can use the arrow buttons to navigate through the menu. Use the arrow to the right button to navigate to Menu 7, Control. Use the arrow up button to go to Menu 7.1, Relay 2, to change the function of the second relay output. Press PROG to change this setting. You can use the arrow buttons to change the setting to Pre-Close to enable the two-stage control output. Press PROG to store this setting. Relay 2 will now switch off at a certain quantity, which is programmed in Menu 7.6, Pre-Close. Use the Arrow Up button to go to Menu 7.6, Pre-Close. Press PROG to change this setting. Use the numerical keys to enter the desired remaining quantity of 100 gallons. Press PROG to store this setting. Relay 2 is now set as two-stage control output. It will switch off 100 gallons before the end of the batch, which is the switch-off moment of Relay 1. Use the arrow down button to go to Menu 7.2, Trans 1, to change the function of the first transistor output. Press PROG to change this setting. You can use the arrow buttons to change the setting to PUMP to enable the pump control output. Press PROG to store this setting. Transistor Output 1 will now switch on at a certain period before the start of the batch, which is programmed in Menu 7.5, Pre-Open. Use the Arrow Up button to go to Menu 7.5, Pre-Open. Press PROG to change this setting. Use the numerical keys to enter the desired time delay of 5 seconds. Press PROG to store this setting. Transistor Output 1 is now set as Pump Control Output. It will switch on 5 seconds before the switch-on moment of Relay 1, which is the start of the batch. All Fluidwell N-Series have the same intuitive operation and menu structure. When you know one, you know them all. Fluidwell understands your success counts.